All right, so we're just arriving at the airport. I am going to be going to Atlanta for the next few days for training, uh, BMW training, sales training. I don't even know really what the training is. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna be leaving the car here for the next few days. Let me get it out of here before I stall it again. I always, always stall it whenever I'm leaving. Man, this thing is so far away. Car so low. Okay. But, like I said, we're at the airport now. I'm gonna get to Atlanta here tonight. I gotta go to Charlotte, and then my plane's already delayed, and then they changed the plane that I'm getting on there. So now I'm not gonna get back to the hotel probably until like 11 o'clock. So it's gonna be a long day. It's only one o'clock right now. We'll see you guys later. Catch you guys in Atlanta. About to come in. Probably gonna get another delay. So we got good reads going on today. Gonna finish this book probably. Probably not gonna get to my hotel until probably about midnight, honestly. My flight lands in Atlanta at 9.30, so who knows how long it's gonna take for the land. We're currently waiting in line to see if we can get a board change because the plane got canceled, so. Who knows where we're sleeping tonight. All right, so we're not gonna wait in that line. We are headed to another plane. Frontier is gonna take us to Atlanta. Definitely not waiting in this long line. Just booked a new flight. I gotta go all the way back through everything and head over to Terminal A. I'm in Terminal B right now, so who knows how long it's gonna take, but the plane takes off in 50 minutes. I gotta sprint over there. Right now, I'm casually walking, so I'll catch you guys later. Peace. All right, so as if today already wasn't long and stressful enough, the Frontier plane that I got is overbooked. So now we're heading back over to the front desk to see if we can get refunded and see what else we can do. I'm just trying to get to the training tomorrow. I don't... And get a good night's sleep. I got a king bed waiting for me in a nice little hotel. So we'll see how that goes. I'm trying to get out of this airport. I hate airports. But all right, so we got refunded. We got a new flight. We're headed to Georgia. Hopefully the plane leaves at 9.45. So I have to go get back through TSA again. Go find the gate 17 wait probably like another hour and then hop on a plane this is a direct flight though i'm happy about that last time i was going from here and there so i i'm happy that i'm just gonna get there go to sleep hopefully i don't have to take a sub a subway because it's gonna be late i ain't trying to do all that i'm probably gonna grab an uber we'll see so we've been waiting for tsa for 40 minutes we're about to go in for the second time Hopefully. All right, so it's currently 9.30. We're still waiting. There's so many people in line. Hopefully we get in. I have a ticket, so I'm pretty sure I'll be okay. Quick, you can see. So many people. All right. About time. We're in. I didn't think it was going to happen. I'm going to sleep so good on this plane. I was going to read a little bit, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to sleep. <laughs> All right, see you when we touch down. This aircraft has eight emergency exits. There are two door exits in the front, two door exits in the rear of the cabin. In addition, there are four door exits mid-cabin.
just getting to be one o'clock in the morning now. Just got off of the plane. That was a day. Um, we are now going to go to the front, get the Uber to the hotel, and get some rest. Good night. got to the hotel right across the street we got a Hooters and a Hard Rock it's funny that them two are right next to each other I'm not gonna make any jokes but I don't know what this thing is but it's pretty cool I'm gonna go check into the hotel now and see if I can go get in my bed and get all comfortable all right, so we're inside of the hotel it's really nice here Nice fitness room. Computers, nice little lounge. Breakfast in the morning, I'm so excited. I'm gonna go to the hotel room now. Uh, All right, so this is the most quiet elevator I've ever been in my life. We just shot up nine floors in like two seconds. We're here, nine, 24. So we finally made it to the hotel. I'm just exhausted. Sorry for the voice. Wait. Oh, look at this bed. I don't have nothing to watch on TV, but hopefully they got some way to log into Netflix. But. Oh, this is well needed. <laughs> See you in the morning. Alright, so good morning. We are on our way to training right now. Uh, had to go down to the front lobby, grab a toothpaste, grab some stuff to shave. But we are on our way, so peace. See you later. Alright, so they got us on a little bit of a break right now. Gonna go take a step outside get some sun cold in here. It's been a long day. I am ready. I don't know if I'm going to go to the aquarium after work today or if I'm going to go tomorrow. Today after this we have a open bar so I'm definitely going to be getting some drinks. Hopefully it's at a, like a nicer bar with like a nice view of the city going to be doing some exploring at some point today though so hopefully this ends soon have you done your disc assessment before you came here and i just want to make sure if you can bring up the results we don't looks mm -hmm. amazing all right so we just got back from training you know they got the room all ready for us again just to relax uh we got reception here in a little bit Get some drinks, more food, and then I don't know what I'm going to do tonight as far as exploring. It's literally like 60 degrees outside. It's cold. <laughs> but look at the view. There is none. I, I really don't know what it is. If you look, it looks like it's like a museum of some sort. Like, I, I don't know. The lights were on all night. Who knows, but I don't know if I'm gonna stay in these clothes. I really didn't bring much from here for three days, and I packed three days worth of clothes, enough for just the training. 
I don't know. We'll see. No. All right, so we just got back to the hotel, had a few drinks, ate a little bit of food, you know, mingled, had a break the ice with all the other people that we were with today. Uh, today was pretty chill, super cool training. Uh, learning more how to become a better genius and learning the sales process. I've also talked to the people that are doing the training and told them about how I would like to get into management one day and they're opening up the, the process just a little bit more to me. So I was able to talk to them a little bit more about that. So not too sure what we're about to do now. I'm about to go look up some pricing for the aquarium. I know it closes at eight and it's about six o'clock right now. So I don't know if two hours is gonna be enough to walk around the whole entire thing. Uh, maybe go head over to the world of Coca-Cola. Maybe walk to the Mercedes-Benz Stadium, but I don't know. Oh, I'm still so tired. All right, I almost feel like I'm back in Pittsburgh walking down this hill, but we're almost at the Georgia Aquarium. Uh, we're gonna go in and see how much it costs. I don't know if they have afternoon pricing. It's like I said, it's like the last two hours. Uh, so we'll see. Uh, if not, we get out a little earlier tomorrow and then even more so on Thursday. So I might have more time one of those two days, but either way, we're gonna, they're moving. But anyways, we're gonna go over to, I think it's called Olympic Park or something like that. Yeah, Olympic Park. Uh, and walk around, see how it is over there. Atlanta's pretty nice so far. And here I am doing exactly what I didn't want to do, just walking around downtown Atlanta, at least the city part. But I'm looking for somewhere to eat. It's dinner time, I'm hungry. They still have a whole trolley system going. I didn't even notice the, the rails up above. So we just got some food. We got the heat game on. I would say it's a successful day. I don't know. How about you guys? How, how was everyone's day? Jeez, oh man, I need a better camera. Okay, this is either gonna be really good or really bad because of the saran wrap. Like it's about to be either wet and soggy or surprisingly good. So we're about to figure that out now. So the moment of truth. It don't look too bad. I like the corn. I mean, it looks. Okay, never mind. This might. I'm gonna eat a little bit of it. I can't tell if this thing was just on like a frying pan or what, or if it's old. <laughs> that looks old, but it's cut. I don't know. I'm about to chow down though. Fuck it. What's up? Hi. No, not up. <laughs> That's a new thing. How are you? Good, how are you? Sit down. Alright, so day two is over with training. Uh, we are headed to the Georgia Aquarium now because we got out a little earlier today than we did yesterday. 
So we're heading over there now. It's a little pricey to get in there, but I guess it costs a lot to feed those fish. You'll see when we get in there, it's uh, I'm pretty positive it's the biggest in the nation. So yeah, I love aquariums. I love going to the zoo. SeaWorld's like my favorite. So uh, getting to see this will be awesome. So I'm happy that I get to show it off. So enjoy. Predators of the deep over here. We got food place. Looks like we got some seals over there, maybe. River Scout, Dolphin Coast, Cold Water Quest, Virtual Reality, o Ocean Voyager. Got a pretty cool projector up here, and then a tropical diver. So Let's go start over here and then we'll make our way around. scary sight it's about as close as I want to get to that thing's face
keep getting more and more excited. We're walking up a ramp right now, which, oh my gosh. Look at this view. This thing is huge. And then there's one in the back. Huge. So these are living sand dollars. If you look super closely, they're actually moving. I always wondered where these things came from. And if we found them all, <laughs> that was always a big question I had. Did we, do we find all of the sand dollars? Like, are we gonna be able to find any more? Oh well, yeah, they're living. They're born every day, die every day. That's awesome. Things move pretty far in 30 seconds. This fish tank actually is awesome because I've actually had a bunch of these rummy nose tetras in a tank. And they're pretty pricey fish and they got like the hundreds of them in here. Super awesome. Beautiful little fish too. Oh man, these things freak me out. Electric eels. Scary. Who left yeah. Uncle Chuck outside drinking all night? Right, so I guess we got some bugs in here. Aquanauts. Who knows what's going on in here? Pretty cool vibe though. Well, this looks cool. I don't think we can go through it, but 
Maybe you can. Nah. Look at this little chubby guy. Right now, I feel like I'm in. I feel like I'm in the movie Jaws. I feel like something's gonna happen. There's some eerie music playing. With all these sharks and these encounters. before my phone dies it's close it's on one percent so hopefully this saves but other than that we had a great day we're out of here peace we're headed out of the hotel it was a nice little week but we're out back to florida where's the dog <laughs> mm, food smells good we got some soup some chicken parmesan and some meatballs. That is amazing. And some tiramisu. I've actually never tried this before. That might be the first time I'm saying it. <laughs> but anyways, this looks amazing. out of Atlanta now we just had some little live music now we're about to head to the TSA hopefully today is not as long as a process as it was the other week the other day uh, we were from the air at the airport from like noon to midnight so today should be easy we're getting here around four we got to get on the plane around seven o'clock and we should should be home by 10 p.m. tonight we got work tomorrow at 10 in the morning, so we'll see. All right, we're getting on the plane. We're going back to Florida. See you when we touch down. All right, so this was way easier of a process getting back to Orlando. Uh, no delays, no hangovers, no waits. Uh, we just took off, landed, got off the plane, was able to find my car easy. Well, I'm still walking to it, but you know, we got that 2001 BMW with the Apple CarPlay in it. So it shows us where our car's parked. 
my parked car. I got the location on, it's walking me to it right now. So, clutch. But yeah, we had a good week. I uh, hope everyone enjoys the video uh, and enjoys the days with Blaze. So, uh, see you in the next one.